Hey, how you doing? My name is Kevin Collick. I'm a success coach with TRIO here at Cleveland Community College, and we serve Cleveland County Schools. And we wanted to take some time to answer one of our frequently asked questions uh, for our seniors. And that question is, what does it mean if a program is competitive? What does it mean if a program is competitive? And in short, if a program is a competitive program, that means it requires for you to apply to be accepted. So let me talk a little bit about what that means. So first of all, you can have a competitive program in a two-year school, a, ju a junior college or community college school, or at a four-year university. So let me explain. Here at Cleveland Community College, we have our ADN program, our associate's degree in nursing. And with that program, you're required to apply to Cleveland Community College, get accepted, take prerequisites, complete those, take some more general ed classes, and then you need to take a TEAS test, which is a test similar to like your ACT or your SAT, all right? You'll take that test and pass it, then you will have fulfilled the requirements so that you can now apply to the School of Nursing and then get accepted to the School of Nursing and then finish up your associate's degree in nursing. That's what makes it competitive. There's additional steps that you have to do and you're not guaranteed to get accepted and there's other people fighting you for a position to get into the program. Same thing at a four year school, for example, NC State has a great engineering program. You go in as a freshman, you take your general ed classes, you fulfill your prerequisites, same thing, right? Then after you do all the things you need to do, now you can apply to the School of Engineering and hopefully get accepted if you fulfill all the requirements and do all the things that you need to do properly, okay? So that's what it means to be in a competitive program or to want to apply to a competitive program. So that's different with some programs, like I did a psychology program. I got my bachelor's in arts of psychology. And so guess what? I did, it wasn't a competitive program. All I had to do was declare my major as a psychology major. And then I finished my four years and I got my psychology degree. If you go to a two year school and you do, um, if you uh, do uh, electrical courses or if you do welding courses, um, certain courses that you do or certain certifications that you're trying to get at a community college, it won't be a competitive program in that you have to do additional steps and then apply to a particular school inside of that community college, okay? So that's what that means. If you guys have any questions for us about it, you just let us know. Thank you.